Is there a potential for, given the understanding of this, is there a potential for using this for organ transplant patients oh, yeah. where it locally would stop recognizing this as a foreign well, that's exactly organ? What, that's exactly what is done. In fact, you, um, when you get a tissue transplant or an organ transplant, you're suppressing the immune system. The problem with that suppression is that you then put yourself at risk right. of cancer because what you're doing is you're turning off the immune system's ability to, to combat and go after a cancer the moment it forms. So most people who are under immune suppression are at risk both of, let's say, virus infections, bacterial infections, but also further cancers. So would the, the potential be to turn that off locally so you could turn that off to this on the, the specific the, organ? That would be a great thing to do if we could. Right now, the only things that we have are systemic. So right. yeah, I mean, for instance, if you could deliver to the organ that you're transplanting anti-immunosupp, you know, basically immunosuppressives locally, that would be great. We don't have that yet, but that would be via a form of gene therapy.